What is the process that gets you down to seven? Uh, really just like, uh, if I can see if I can like put myself in the scheme, uh, relationship with the coaches. Um, also, if I can just like see if, like, if I can feel myself there for three to four years, so yeah. Okay, and you were recently at USC for the second time, right? Yes. And at the spring game. And mm -hmm. can you just talk about that experience and, and what you got maybe out of this visit that you didn't out of the first one? Uh, really just like being around the uh, players on the uh, team right now, just getting like their perspective on USC. Also just like seeing like the USC fans and the atmosphere of like a spring game would be close to like a uh, real like actual game. So yeah. That was the most USC has ever had for a spring game, the <laughs> attendance wise. Uh, even during the peak Carroll years, I think 25,000 was about the most that they got. They filled out the stadium on Saturdays, but the spring game, but that energy is just, can you talk about what the energy was like in the Coliseum from your perspective? Uh, I can tell that USC is on the rise. Uh, fans are cheering after every single big play, any, actually any play that's made. So yeah. Um, and just the relationship, the, the, when we first talked, it was in February. And you were just kind of developing a relationship with Coach Dante. Can you talk about where that's gone since then? Yeah, uh, Coach, Coach Dante, he's my guy now. We talk every single day on a daily basis. Uh, he's always checking up on me, asking how uh, school was, how practice was, asking me to send him uh, uh, practice clips and things like that, just perfecting me and things, like, and things like that. So, yeah. Did you get to spend some time with him when you were at USC this last time? Yes. Yeah, we had yeah, a long conversation. It's over about USC and like uh, what his plan for me is for the next three or four years. So yeah. Is, is there is there other stuff at USC? There's a lot of momentum at USC right now. Mm -hmm. I mean that weekend that you're going to visit in June. Yeah. Have you seen the list? Uh huh. Yeah, I've seen it. Man. Uh, so, uh, and what what are you feeling? What's the vibe at USC right now for you? Uh, I can tell they want to be a winning program. Um, I can tell that Coach Riley, uh, he. He's capable of doing it, just uh, needs uh, the right class to start off with in the 2023 class is what he told me. And he wants us to uh, build a momentum for 24 and 25 class too, so yeah. Did you have a relationship with, with the guys that are at USC now when they were at Oklahoma? Yeah, they started recruiting me freshman year. So yeah, I've been talking to them ever since freshman year, Coach Grinch, Coach Riley. And then when Coach Manning was a cornerback coach, I still keep in contact with him, but now he's a linebacker coach, so yeah. All right. Uh, any other official visits that you're going to take? Uh, Cal on May 12th and then Clemson and the USC. All right. All right, Braxton Myers.